Let's learn how to use Weld in Cricut Design Space on your iPad. Weld will join or fuse um, two or more elements together. I really like to use it for text. It helps to take those individual letters and connect them together in a script font. Let me show you what I'm talking about. If I go into my text and I find a script font, That one looks nice. And we're going to type up the word weld. So now I'm going to make this a little bigger so we can see it nice. You can see that the letters aren't touching. So if I go into edit, I can click on letter spacing and use the down button to bring those letters closer together. And now they're touching. Um, maybe I want to do it just a little bit more. There we go. So now with the whole word selected, I would go to actions and I can click the weld button. And now that word is welded together. And I can tell that it's welded together because over here it says it's going to cut a welded image. So now instead of cutting out four individual letters that I would have to apply to my project, it's going to cut out the whole word weld. And I want to show you another thing with this. If I do the text again, and let's try this word. Okay. So here's my sample. If I'm in edit and I use my letter spacing and just keep going down to bring the letters together. Well, this is actually a really good example. So you see how the A, M, and P, their spacing looks really good, but then there's a big gap between the P and the L. So if your letter spacing doesn't work to bring the letters close enough, what I like to do sometimes is go under actions and hit ungroup. Now, these are each individual letters instead of a full word. So then what I can do is I can say, okay, I like, I like how E and L are grouped together. That's a good spacing for me. So I can weld those two letters together. And I like how a and P is, so I'm going to weld those together. I'm going to bring S over in here. And since I moved that around a little bit, I'm going to take all of those elements and under edit, I'm going to say align them to the top and see how it made the S jump up. So now it's all in line with the other ones. Now I can go back to actions and weld those. Now I can bring, see how this is working as one piece. I'm actually gonna go back there. Now I can bring the P over to the L and see right there, you can actually see it still is gonna cut the P separate from the L until you do this and hit weld and see how that cut line just disappeared in there. So now this whole thing's welded together. Instead of cutting individual letters, it's going to cut one full word. So that's how you use weld to take your cursive writing from individual letters to full words. I hope this helped you to understand the using weld Make sure to like my video and subscribe to my YouTube. Thanks.